What's going on Spartans? King here and today we're going to be doing a special episode for the new update and we're going to do a really simple farming to max episode. Unfortunately last night I did lose over 1.5 million in raids due to the fact that I was winning over 300,000 of each in uh, collector bases just killing it and then the update of course deleted all of my gameplay so unfortunately i'm gonna keep this a short episode just gonna upgrade two mines actually one mine and one collector look at how awesome they're gonna look and the increases on these are gonna be pretty pretty awesome an extra 500 per hour is always helpful and of course that extended amount of loot that you can store now as soon as those upgrade, I will show you how they look. Maybe I'll do a gemming them complete. Like, I don't want to spend gems on resources, but ever again, as I told you guys. But I would be okay with spending gems to increase time because I'm going to run out of builders really fast trying to upgrade these things. And I want to continue to upgrade my defenses. So as soon as I have my defenses upgraded, I have like 8 million. I will probably gem one of those done just to like buy myself time and be able to upgrade another defense. So we're going to show you a raid real quick. And then we'll call this episode quits. But as you can see, just did a really simple town hall snipe against me right there. That was a defense. People are doing that a lot. And that's the reason I'm doing this base. Everyone's like, why do you have so many resources showing? Why aren't you resetting your traps? Because I'm saving loot by not resetting my traps and not refilling my expo and my inferno tower. It actually saves you like 100,000 plus elixir and gold every single defense. And since I never have to fill them I log off every like 20 minutes and don't bother with it so I save a ton of loot every day I do one attack log off blah 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 blah. here's me searching found a really simple base really fast and it's been really good in crystal 3 guys as I told you I'm gonna be doing an episode on the best places to farm and why and at what town hall and what league you need to farm at in those areas so I'll definitely have a very educational video coming out either later today or tomorrow I'm gonna take a break for a few hours this update has made me do a lot of work and I've been farming a lot, so I will definitely have some more episodes out very shortly. And those educational ones, I'll be doing how to balloon you real soon, so stay tuned for that. As you can see, those super easy, dropping hella wall breakers down to get into these walls here. And kind of failed, but we are going to go ahead and kill everything and take all that loot real quick. Ton of loot showing, and it's very easy to get to. Now, I will start attacking bases. As I go lower, I'm sure I'll start seeing the vault bases. At which point I will start showing you techniques on how to get into vault bases and why I bring two jump spells, etc. And I'll start bringing rage spells once we get to that scenario. Because especially with the wizards and mortars and how many mortars and wizards there are now, you should definitely have rage spells and jump spells when you're using goblins. And as you can see, we want a ton of loot. Got pretty much all the dark elixir too. Yep, we just got it all. Bingo. There we go. 55% too, and that's just with my goblins and archers, and I mostly had goblins. But we will check exact numbers in a second here. As you can see, 150 goblins, 60 archers, 12 wall breakers, and over 200,000 of each stolen. 190,000 gold to be exact and 260,000 elixir. Now I'm going to rebuild my troops here. And as you can see, I just build a few wall breakers at the beginning of most of my barracks. And I just do it really randomly. But I try and keep it so that I have between 6 and 15 wall breakers at all times. So I can do multiple raids in a row if I don't want to rebuild my wall breakers. And I usually only use like six wall breakers unless I accidentally drop them all like I did in my last raid. I dropped all of them when I meant to drop just a couple. But that happens. And mistakes are meant to happen in this game, obviously. But stay tuned for the next episode, and I will definitely see you guys shortly. Peace.